Hey everybody, what we're going to be tying this evening is a Tin Man. It's an old fashioned Smoky Mountain pattern that catches the fish in the streams of Smoky Mountains or even to late harvest waters. So I thought for the next two or three months we'd tie some old fashioned Smoky Mountain patterns. So let's get going. Now, what we're going to be using here for a hook is a scud hook, um, size 14 here. Now this is a lightning strike hook, you can use a TMC, whatever your preference is. Uh, you can tie this from about a 12 to an 18. We're going to use a black brass bead, okay, it's 3 30 seconds. Now you could also use a tungsten bead if you wished, but, you know, your preference. Use some two millimeter scud back material from the South Holston River Fly Shop. Alrighty. Use some peacock curl. Pheasant tail for the tail. Alrighty. Body's gonna be that's root beer flashaboo. Okay. Gonna rib the body with some fine gold tinsel. Okay. Alrighty. And our legs are gonna be black flash boot. Okay. You can also use crystal flash for this. So let's get the tie. Okay, I've already got the thread on my on my hook here. We're ready to go for it. So let's get going here. Okay. Now tail is going to be a fest, about three pheasant tail feathers. You just cut them off there and tie them in about the length of the hook. Okay. Keeping those feather tail up on top of the hook. Just that just a little bit. Okay. Come back up here. Take it all the way back down. Trim it right there. Okay. Next thing we're going to do is we're going to take our ribbing, tie that in. Okay. up here and just come right back down just like this all the way to the end of the hook then we're going to take a couple strands of this root beer flash of boot and we're going to start again right behind the the bead up here three strands. Okay. I'm going to just trim those off even. And I'm going to capture them here. This way. And you're gonna wrap those. Just coming forward. Get your nice little body. Now you can use crystal or pearl if you want. Use about any color you want to. It's just that's the beauty of this fly. You can make so many different modifications on it and it still catches fish. Come over just like this. Okay. And once in the front to pinch it down a little bit. Trim this. Okay. Take and just wrap our put a ribbing on right here. And I think the best way to kind of wrap that. Okay. 
just nice even wraps as you go up the hook. There we go. Okay. Tie that off. Oops, sorry. trick here is sometimes you get a little tab of that tinsel so just make sure you wrap down a couple times keep that from severing the scud back you're going to tie in right now okay now we're just going to tie this in capture that like that keep that up on top of the hook come back just a ways Come back up this way. And take a couple strands of peacock curl. Pin up on the size of 14. You can do two. I'd say a 16 or 18. I would do maybe one. Okay. Three turns just like that, you go. Know, nice little thorax. Okay. Now, you can stop at this point, pull that scud back over, and you're done, or you can put some legs on it. Now, for legs, you can use a lot of different things. You can use a little tiny rubber legs if you want to. Uh, mohair works real well. I like that a lot. We're going to do something a little bit funky here today. Okay. Now, crystal flash is a little bit finer. Tie these in. Okay, just capture it like that. A couple wraps. One, let's trim this a little bit. Yep, lost that too. Okay, let's just do this. Let's trim this little fritter off right here. There we go. All right. Oh my gosh, we're losing control here. Okay, well, that's okay. We'll just back up a bit. I knew things were going too well. Okay, here we go. Okay, back to the drawing board, Chief. Let's do it here. just did if you notice try to prevent that little uh-oh from happening again after I wrapped got the peacock tied down I went back to here and wrapped it here and then came back this way kind of did a little X there which will keep this thing hopefully if I trim it too short from doing the same thing again okay let's get another piece of the black flash blue we will start this process again of the legs. Okay. Okay. There. There we go. 
this thing around. Flash boo over, tie it down. Got two wraps over it. I'm gonna do another wrap over it. I'll pull it up, wrap down. Just gonna trim that. And put a good old fashioned whip finish on it. Trim the legs, and we're done. Are a personal preference. I probably like mine just a tad longer than the average bear. That's okay. Like this. And there we go. The Tin Soldier. Again, a thing of beauty. So, enjoy.